Corey, this plant says, go f yourself. <laughs> Yo. yeah, I thought we were keeping it light today. <laughs> today going to the Garfield Park Conservatory, one of my absolute favorite places in the city. Uh, also one of the most underutilized places in the city in my opinion, especially since it's free. But before I take you guys to the Garfield Park Conservatory, I wanted to give you an update on one of the projects that I talked to you guys about in the last vlog. Let me show you guys where we're at on the new sketch comedy video that me, Sean, and Zacko have coming out. Take a look at this. Check that out. This is the timeline. I'm in, the, I'm about three quarters of the way of done editing this video. So it's kind of what the timeline looks like. It should be coming out soon in the next couple weeks. Uh, also want to talk to you guys about another project that I have coming up. So let's do another episode of Future Projects. The future has finally arrived. The future is bright. Tonight, we toast the future. It doesn't hurt to start thinking about the future. What about the future? So this is man's future. All right, so let's talk about stand-up. I don't know if a lot of you guys know this, but I've worked on a couple of stand-up shows in Chicago. Here, let me, show you, let me show you some pictures for a little storytelling. So oh, here's at one of the buzz shows. You can see the buzz sign kind of in the background. Some really great comedians in here. Aaron Branch there. Ah, Mike Robinson right there. Absolute legend. See, the buzz shows were my first foray into running a stand-up show. Shout out to my friend AJ Lubecker. He started the show, he's an amazing stand-up comedian, and he asked me to be part of the show as a host and producer. Uh, then he moved to LA, gave me the keys to the show, ran that show for three years, one of the most fun times of my life. I absolutely loved it. Me and Sean made a couple vlogs for the Buzz show. I'll link them below. We did them on the Number Six with Cheese channel. There's, it just shows how fun it was to have this show at the Playground Theater and then have an after party at my apartment. It would always be packed. We'd always have an absolute blast. And that was one of two shows that I ran in Chicago. I also had a show at the Laugh Factory with Zacco called Burnt. Let me show you this. Here's a vlog we made about the Laugh Factory show. Burnt was a, a uh, it was a roast battle show. It was a super awesome show. So why am I talking to you guys about stand-up shows? Actually, it's nice out. So let me, let's go up to the roof since it's so nice out. Talk about up there. So, so why am I talking about stand-up? So there's this idea that me and Zacco have been kind of throwing around for quite a long time now. The idea is essentially to create what Tiny Desk is for music, but for stand-up in Chicago. Let's create this stand-up show that we can get high quality video and audio from and turn it into additionally, other than a, a stand-up show, also a YouTube channel. So when's the show happening? I don't know, could be soon, could be a month, could be two months. Now we just have to find a venue, book the talent, run the show, make the channel, and have fun. So that's the newest project I'm working on. I'll keep you guys updated as the show kind of continues to be created. Hopefully soon we'll have a monthly live show that anybody in Chicago can come to, and we'll also have weekly content from that show that will go online. So that's it for that. Let's go to the conservatory now. Yellow. Oh my god, I knew that was coming. Got the crew ready to go to, uh, we're going to Garfield Park Conservatory. So we're gonna go hit the train up. Red Line, downtown, transfer to Orange or Green Line, I think Green Line, to Garfield Park Conservatory. That's how that goes. Is that air on the Yeah, it's, it's a, a muggy one, bro. Steamer. It's a fucking muggy one, again. It's like 90 degrees out, brutally hot. Kind of a dumb decision to wear a black shirt. So trying to counteract that with a little bit of Gatorade. It's not gonna help much though. Cubs game today, so there's a lot of people out by the train.
so I'm really sweaty from being in that train. Right, right, right. I just love looking down this street, catching a little. Ready for one, That is fucking sick. <laughs> yeah, that is sick. Update on the uh, heat situation here. Uh, I'm covered in sweat. I don't know if you guys can see how disgusting I am. I could feel the sweat drip down my butthole. I was correct to assume that the Gatorade did little to nothing to help me in this hot blistering day. Wearing black was definitely dumb. I'm a stupid idiot. And I don't appreciate you laughing at this, at my pain. Okay, so we are at the Garfield Park Conservatory. AJ and Kylie, I'm excited for them because they have never been to the conservatory. Never. Oh, you guys are in for a fucking treat. I'm just excited for the AC. Me too. Hello. Hi. I had a reservation today for one o'clock. All right, as you make your way to the conservatory, you're fully vaccinated and masks no longer required. Thank you so much for coming in. You have a fantastic tour. Cool, thank you much. Check this place out. Bro, how about this, huh? Yeah, this is awesome. So I think this is the this is the Palm House. There's like looked like five or six different rooms. Yeah. But um, yeah, we'll show you some beer all of it. What'd you find? Fly trap. Venus flytrap. Yeah. Oh, they probably got to put it in here because the people, people are probably be messing with shit. it. Yep. Venus flytrap. <laughs> cool. How you feel about this little view right here? Oh, you kidding me? Pretty, <laughs> you feeling good about that? Are you kidding? I love friends. It just doesn't seem like it should exist in Chicago, you know? Right. <laughs> love it. want to sneak back into the employees yeah, only right? spot Always. I'm not going back there but I want to what I tell you about breaking the rules and Th that they're meant to much. be broken That's no right I told you I'm gonna stop going in public with you <laughs> <laughs> So that was, that was the fern room. How do you feel about the fern room? I'm all about the fern room. This oh. is, all right, heading into the Show House Horticulture Hall Jensen Room. Hell of a name. on the aeroid house. What the hell? I don't even know what the hell an aeroid is. I don't, I don't even know if I'm saying it right. Oh yeah, here we go. This is one of my favorite rooms too. You know, my mom was a cactus lady. Yeah. Is it because everything looks um, flaccid? No, it looks, what's it when it's penis shaped? Oh yeah. Uh, Phallus shaped? Phallic, yeah, yeah. phallic. phallic yeah. <laughs> You guys thought I was being a baby when I was talking about how hot it is. Yep, that's uh, it's over 100 degrees. 
That explains all my back sweat. Okay, so now we've got, this is the Sugar from the Sun Palm House. Alright, so that's the loop, guys. Oh, we're at, this is the end? Yeah, we're back to the beginning. Oh, we didn't check the outside. How do you guys feel about it? What's your, uh, your conservatory rating? Very cool. So that's the conservatory. Uh, love this place. Definitely come here. It's off the green line in Chicago, west side of the, of the city. Um, not sure what we're doing next. Probably head back to our side of town, get the dog. I don't know. I'll keep you up to date. More fun to come. Hello. Hello. Yes. Ready to go potty? That's a good girl. Back home, taking the, uh, taking the dog out. Uh, also, there's a Cubs game going on today. I just love that you can see the Cub, into the Cubs stadium from this part. It's so sick. It is now pouring out. This is crazy. You probably can't see it very well on the camera, but... AJ's over. <laughs> we are uh, playing FIFA, and I'm 2-0 because I may be the greatest FIFA player of all the time. Let's go ahead and take a look at this replay. Mm. And then just get a nice, beautiful little crossing. Let me grab that header real quick. That looks tasty. And uh, yeah, it was. <coughs> AJ also scored, it wasn't a big deal. Yeah, AJ got another one. Also wasn't a big deal. So a lot of people would say that it was luck more than anything. Yes, AJ did. He did win in the first game, but everyone knows that I'm an away game player, and uh, this is a, a home and away series, so everyone knows that I played my best work as the away team, and then I'm going to come back and smack the dog dick out of your, out of your mouth. He's got one another, it's not looking good, guys. That's all I'll say. Not looking good. You won the first home and away, I won the second home and away. Winner player two, that's not me. It's, uh... it's a sad day for old Corey Wagner. Not for me. <laughs> <laughs> After the beat down in FIFA, I'm being blessed with, uh, I should face the window because it's probably better lighting. I'm, I'm being blessed with Roost to kind of quench the sadness that is flowing through my veins because of AJ's merciless beat down of me in FIFA. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, or no no, wait, wait. I forgot to mention that uh, Roost is in yeah, Wrigleyville, that's a, that's a so going right through, uh, right past the Cup Stadium. All right, we're in the we're in the belly of the beast here. We're on Clark Street. This is where all the Cubs bars are. It's, it's nuts out here. Carolina style. I like oh the my god. These are looking delicious. The Carolina style chicken sandwich from Roost. It's unbelievable. Oh my god. Oh, the food is a resounding success. Roost is a certified truth. It's so delicious and tasty. And Wrigley is a rowdy right now. Now we're heading to 7-Eleven to grab some wine. Time to do a little drinking. Two, three, four, five. Not that good. Loser has to drink uh, a shot of Fireball. <laughs> Today, I'm pretty sure that's me. In my four of a kind, I got 18, but you got 40 on the large straight. All right, friends, fun day party. That's right. See you, see ya. Yes, sir. Bye. It's late. I'm tired. We're going to watch a movie and go to bed. Another long day done. This tree is like layered with three different colors. Oh, yeah. Cool. It's the Neapolitan ice cream of trees. <laughs>